that's what they just say. Riding down 17, how about them? So, let's talk about your other business venture, because I know you got some other things going on. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, I got, uh, I just started my own, uh, custom, uh, company, but it's bigger than just, just customizing the artist. It's uniforms, you know, it's uniform art. It's, uh, when you actually, this is your uniform. When you perform with somebody, that's your uniform too. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it a custom uniform custom company. It's uniform. You gotta, you gotta know how to present yourself. That's big. Presenting yourself the right way because you are a product, and a product you gotta have a package, and the package must be beautiful. So you made that package beautiful. Come shop with me. And of course, I got Tokyo Beauty Bar, man. That's, that's nails, hair, MUA, lashes, weave, good weave. I'm talking about straight off the head, you feel me? Uh, hair products, all that one stop shop. Tokyo Beauty Bar, you know, it's off that line, man. Come rock with me. I'm thinking about expanding. Well, I know I'm going to expand. We're just getting everything together right now. Uh, yeah, Tokyo Beauty Bar, Sauce Milk Customs. Um, shh, you know I do the events. Just got a whole lot going, man. A whole lot. So, go ahead and drop the address for the location so people know where to pull up to. Uh, so that's uh, 0171 Park Lane Road, Columbia, South Carolina, next to Columbia Mall, Columbia Place Mall. Easy to find. Easy to find and a great location. Pull up on me. So tell us how you feel about the music scene in South Carolina. It's growing. Th think it's going in the right direction? I mean, yeah. Because, you know, I came from an era where it was better for uh, the morality. As far as advancing, it's getting better. I'm loving it. It's just the morality, the more should be done. You know what I mean? Yeah. See, so what's wrong with a lot of new, new artists, a lot of new people. It's so easy now to do the shit that we took a lot for us to do. So when it comes so easy, they show less respect to it. So when you're showing less respect to it, that shit, you. Your respect for the pioneers ain't where it should be. Now, when you don't respect the pioneers like that, now the pioneers ain't gonna help vouch for you. Yeah, a lot of y'all like to say, I don't need no vouch, I don't need no nobody to vouch for me. Bullshit. Yes, the fuck you do. Somebody gotta vouch for you to get some type of money, my nigga. That is the dumbest thing you could ever repeat. Cause I know a lot of y'all repeat that because y'all heard some other dumbass rapper in the industry say that when they tell the fucking lie. Everybody, everybody need a fucking voucher in some type of way in order to get their product out there. Because how the fuck I'm going to know about your product if nobody ain't told me. If I'm just looking at, I might not get to your shit on YouTube. I might not be your friend on no social media. I might not know that. Somebody had to vouch for you to get me to go look. Or if I was some big music executive, somebody had to tell me. That mean, some, if somebody had to tell me, that mean they vouch for you. So shut the fuck up with that. Y'all sound as ignorant as the motherfuckers want you to be. Don't be that ignorant. Don't be that ignorant. I want plenty of motherfuckers to vouch for me. Vouch for me, goddamn. Vouch for me. You did. So recently we had a passing of you know, one of Mob Deep member Prodigy. How do you feel about that, man? Oh, man. Shit, bro was a uh, he, he 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 helped change the game man, in a lot of ways. He did, he did, he did. Uh, absolutely, much respect. You know, I'm a pop fan, but at the end of the day, 
is a brother. So right, that's another brother. Gotta salute. Gotta salute. And, and I, I seen an interview saying that before he passed, they made up or something like that, or whatever. Which ain't none of my business, but I be sitting here faking like I'm saying if I'm was the biggest Prodigy fan, I was no big Prodigy fan like that. But I know his music, and I know exactly who the fuck he was. Yeah. Yeah, I know recently after that they threw paint on his mural a couple of times. What you mean? They threw paint on his mural, they painted a mural on the wall in New York. Like on some disrespectful shit? Yeah. Why they do that? You know, man. Damn, that's fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> but man, for the people, man, out there that want to get in contact with Really Rock, go ahead and drop your social media info. Man, hit me up on Instagram, Breezy Rock Music. One word, Breezy Rock Music. Uh, Twitter, at 48 Rock. That's one word, at 48 Rock. Uh, Facebook, I got a uh, Facebook page, T Breezy Rock, and I got Breezy Rock Music, man. Fuck with me. And you, as a matter of fact, you can just type Breezy Rock on Google. Ain't no other reasons out there. Pop up. And if it was another reason, it's too late. You want to catch up, because you pop that in. All my shit coming up. I ain't hard to find. Fuck with me. It is. Eat that. What single you pushing right now? Of course, you did, man. That's the single right now. That's the baby right now. I got a lot of um. I got a lot of new shit that's out. A lot of new videos that's coming out. I'm right now. I'm on the wave shit. Goddamn, I'm up in the wave. It's been a wave time. Man. I don't know what y'all gonna do. Get your headphones and your speakers ready and your fucking. Phones charged up, your flat screen's ready, cause I'm finna be everywhere. All in your face, all in your ear, all in your flyers. I'm finna be everywhere. Big wave coming through, man. Yeah. So I mean, you got a new project about to drop? Yeah. Push I, I got a couple of them. That's your push your main, push. The main thing I'm finna drop is that organic. Okay. Reason rock organic, man. Okay. Organic. You, you want to speak on a little bit about that? That's a, that's a street album. Okay. I, I was I was gonna drop an EP, but I'm gonna make this a street album. Right. Yeah, yeah. So you got, you got, you got, you got a, a frame. You gonna drop it? A time frame? A date? I actually do, but I'm not telling it right now. Okay. It just it's organic. It's coming soon, real soon. I ain't talking about no. I don't know the date, and I just mambling some shit. No, the shit finna come real soon. I'm done, really. It's perfect time. We gotta wait on that perfect time. Y'all make me rush that shit to drop. All my fans out there rush me to drop that shit. And you, you might get it quicker. You might get it quicker. Rush me to do it. Right. That's what's up. Hey, man, we appreciate you coming through. All oh, that, man. man. I had, DME I had TV. a great time. I had a great time, man. Shout out to DME TV. He's a rock fucking with you the dumb way, long way. You know what I mean? You dig that. Eat that. Sparkles in my chain like a night light. Soak up all the game, never lose sight. A lot of niggas lame, they on death. Tough guy, watch out, catch me in your sight. Right it down, 17, how about I say my